In this video, we're going over how to soft reset your LG K51 if the screen freezes. Hey everyone, thank you for joining us today. If you want to stay up to date on all the mobile technology coming out and learn cool tips, tricks, and hidden features, make sure you hit that subscribe button down below and tap the bell to turn on post notifications so you can be alerted every time we post new videos. Today we're going to walk you through what to do if your screen freezes on the LG K51, specifically how to initiate a soft reset, which will basically shut the phone off and then turn it right back on again, which should get your screen working again. So let me show you what to do. You will need to hold down on the power button and the volume down button at the same time for five seconds. Now when you hold these buttons, first the phone is gonna take a screenshot because that's what these buttons normally do, but continue to hold the buttons until you see a message at the bottom which will tell you that the phone is about to initiate a restart. Let me show you right now. Power and volume down, hold them together. You'll see the screenshot, there it is. Just keep holding the buttons. At the bottom, it's not gonna tell you. The restart is in progress. As soon as the phone restarts, let go of the buttons, and it should kick your phone off and turn it right back on again. And hopefully that fixes your problem. Now, one other cool thing I wanted to mention is that uh, there have been some issues with LG K51 phones and um, there is supposed to be an update that's coming to most LG K51s that will fix the problem of the screen going black, which could be the reason why you're on this video right now. So when the screen comes back on, I'm gonna show you guys how to check your settings to see if that update is now available for you. And if it is, you definitely wanna do that update ASAP to avoid any more issues with your phone. It's supposed to fix all the problems. So anyway, swipe now from the top of the screen, Tap on the settings wheel in the corner. From here, you can really just do a, you can swipe all the way down to the bottom if you want, or you can just tap in the search box and just type in update. Give it a second, sometimes the search doesn't allow you to search right away. But just type in update. And then tap on update center. And then tap on system update. And then here it is. It should take you to the latest update um, if your phone has the update available. Now keep in mind, uh, I believe your battery has to be either above 30% or 50% for it to do the update. Um, if it's not, just simply plug in your phone to power and charge it up to at least half before you initiate this. But once you get to 50%, there should be a button on the screen that will allow you to update your software. Uh, and I think in this case, actually, because I have battery saving mode, that's why it won't let me do the update. But if I just swipe down here, I could turn off my battery saver mode here, and then it should give me the option now to do the update. So anyway, guys, look for that update. Make sure if your phone has it, do the update, which should fix all your problems. Uh, and we'll get out of here. Hope you guys did find this helpful. Make sure you like, favorite, and share if it was helpful. Hit that subscribe button and stay tuned for more videos. Take care, and as always, have a good one.